Hello City of Heroes fans, Solar Knight here doing another video. Um, this is a pretty simple one, but something that most people don't um, see or know about for some reason. Uh, probably because at level 10, text pops up for it, and it's just kind of like down here, and then you pass it, and it never mentions it again. So, you can actually have an alternate build, two builds in the game so far that I've seen access to. So what you want to do is you want to go train up to a new level of power, and then select or rename your active build. See, I have a build there, level 39, Soldier Jump, and this is my next one here. Rename current build. Solar Fly. The benefit of this is that um, at around level 30 or so, if you're just like, man, I wish I didn't take this power, I wish I had taken that power, all these kinds of things, you don't have to do a respec. It does not cost you anything. You just come over here and say trade to a new level power, and then select or rename your build. Then when you select your new build, you say confirm. And then what happens is you have to re-slot everything. You have to go over here to her again, and it's like your level one. You have to say train to a new level of power. Then you select your first power that you want to select again, and so on, all the way to your current level. So for me, that meant selecting every single power and adding enhancement slots to every single power all the way up back to level 39 where I was before. That can take a long time and the danger is you have to pay for all new enhancements. None of the enhancements you had on your other build will transfer over so you need to have at least I'd say a million influence laying around to transfer everything even if you have invention enhancements. Ones you create yourself. They will not be there for you to put in your other build. You would need to create all new IOs to go into your new build. That is the danger of this. Um, it can be easier in a lot of ways just to take your free respec because then you'll get to keep all your enhancements and, and then you just throw them in your, your new slots that you have there. But this one's awesome because at any time I can just come up here and say train new level power, select my active build, select that one, say confirm, and bam, I, I have all new powers, every single one that's different. I was able to re-choose everything, and now I don't have powers that I thought, eh, why did I take that? It wasn't really that great. I could choose something better with that power slot. So that is the best way, in my opinion, to be able to make, make up for those choices that you're like, oh, man, that power, why did I take that and never use it? And now you can have something better uh, with very minimal cost, except for the fact that you have to buy all new enhancements. Anyway, that's Solar Knight, and that's how you change and switch between builds.